So in this video, I'm going to show you how to use Pinterest to make your first $200 a day with Shopify, YouTube, uh, your own website, your blog, whatever it is. This works on literally any niche. This is a huge untapped and untapped market. Uh, no one's really using Pinterest right now. Everyone focuses on you know YouTube, YouTube ads, Google ads, Facebook ads, but no one's focusing on Pinterest. And I'm not talking about Pinterest ads. You can actually build this all for free. And I'm going to show you exactly how how to do it. So. I'm going to use this as an example here. Uh, this is an account I created called Design Hub. And this is all about web design, uh, UI design, graphic design, architecture. So this is all about people who are interested in art, design, uh, just design in general. So I named it Design Hub. And I'm going to show you exactly how I grew um, this to 405 followers in less than a week. So this is actually real easy to do. And I'm going to show you how, how you can make money with this later on so this could be in any niche not just design you can use the, uh, the camping niche and just uh, you can use the fishing niche makeup whatever it is so I'm gonna show you exactly how to get started so I'm gonna stick with my own niche and just show you how I started so I'm, I'm just gonna search up web design so what that's gonna do is it's gonna bring up a whole bunch of web design um, UIs so Pinterest is all about just pinning your own ideas, creating your own boards. I'm going to show you exactly what they are. So boards, what I'm going to do is search by boards. So what I've done is, I, these are all boards here. This is a branding board, this is a travel board, this is a web design board. So what I've done is I've actually broken down the design niche into different categories. So there's packaging design, there's architecture, there's graphic design, web design, icon design, furniture design. So uh, let's say you're doing it on camping, you would break your, your uh, camping niche into one one board for tents another board for uh, lighting lamps and all that another one for fishing if fishing falls under you know camping so that's what you need to do so what I've done here is I've just gone and searched in web design and I've just clicked here and I searched it up by board boards only and what I'm gonna do is just click on one of these guys and I'm going to pin a few of this. Actually, you don't need to do this first. I'm going to go back here. First thing you need to do is actually create a board. So I'm going to go back and just search it up all by pins. So what I've done yet, it's still searched up by web design. I'm just going to, and I just search it up by all pins. And what I'm going to do is, um, what you need to do is when you first start, you actually need to create a board. So you, you come down here and just hit create board and just name it web design and keep keep the secret um, at no. If you click yes, then no one will be able to see your board. It's a secret. So I'm gonna cancel this because I've already got web design here, all the way at the bottom. And what I'm gonna do is just pin it there. And what I've done is I've actually, on my web design pin, uh, if I keep scrolling down, so I've got heaps here. I have to find uh, my web design. Where is it, where is it? So don't let this scare you. You can actually do this in real, real easily. It uh, doesn't even matter. I'm just gonna I'm just gonna show you this as an example. So what just happened is this pin is actually pinned into my web design board, and what you need to do is you actually need to pin about uh, about 20 to 40 pins. It's all you can do as many as you want, but 20 to 40 is ideal. So let's say it's camping and it's about tents. Let's just stick with camping. Doesn't have to, you don't have to break into different categories. So you just search up camping. So this would be like a Shopify store or something like that. And you just go, go out and just pin a few of these images. So now you've got your board. And now you, now you, you don't have a, a board with a good amount of pins, but you'd have zero followers. So this is what you do. So I'm, I'm going to show you as a camping, since most of you guys are interested in Shopify dropshipping. So I'm going to go into boards here. And this is going to show me all the camping boards. And I'm going to click one. So these are probably, so this has 123,000 followers. This is doing really well, this board right here. And what I'll do is just click on the followers here. And what I'll do is just follow each and every single one of these people. And what I'll do is I'll actually follow um, about 300 of them. 300 sounds like a lot. It is a bit of a tedious task to just go and hit follow on each one. But that's what, that you have to do that. And what that will do is about 50% of those followers will actually follow you back. So if you follow 300 people, 150 fo uh, people will follow you back. So you're getting 150 followers per day. So that's what I've done here. So I've followed 900 people, 400 people followed me back. 
So th I've actually been slacking here. I could have easily put this up to a thousand if I wanted to. But I've actually just been slacking. I'm going to start making my own website soon for design. And so now that you've got your followers, you're actually gaining about 150 followers. And let's say after 10 days, you have uh, 1,500 followers. Now, how do you make money with these followers? What I, what I would do is, um, I'm going to stick with my niche here, just uh, Design Hub. And what I would do is I would actually um, make my own website on design or make a Shopify store on design or make a YouTube channel on design. And I would sell products. So if it's design, I might sell sketchbooks. So this is a uh, website. This isn't actually my website. This is a website about architecture. And let's just pretend this is my website. So what I want to do is actually promote this page right here. So I'll just copy the link to my website. And I would go in here and just hit this plus button right here. Then I'll come down to save from site. Then what you do is you just click uh, paste, paste the link and hit next. What that will do is it will just bring up all the images from your website. And you pick one of the images. So this one looks kind of cool, so I'm going to click on that. Just hit uh, save, the little pin button right there. Then you scroll down to architecture. So that's the board that I want to pin it to. And just hit save. So now it's actually uh, promoting other people's pages. So you, your, your one will also get promoted once you start getting a, a lot of followers. But uh, I'm not going to follow this one. So I'll just hit C now. So imagine this being your own product. So let's say uh, the, the camping niche that we used as an example. Let's say it's a tent right here. And you say, go buy it now. Click this image and go buy it now. So if I actually click this image, it'll actually go to the design website. So all you have to do is create a bunch of followers on, on, and on the image, just write, go uh, discount, discount of tents available now, go buy it now. It's that simple. You can get a ton of traffic for free if you just keep following, um, just follow the exact methods that I showed you. So I'll just go over it again. So first, first thing you do is you come in here and search up, uh, let, uh, let's, let's, let's try one more thing, fishing. So I'm going to start fishing here. And this can work on any niche. So there's a so I'm going to what I'll do is I'll just go and pin about 20 of these. 20 of these um, pins or these images just to make it look legit, make a board about fishing and just make it look legit. 20 of these. Then what I'll do is go into the boards right here. And I would click on one of these boards and I'll check how many followers they have. So this guy's got 64,000. That's really good. Then I would hit follow on all of these people. Not all of them, 300 per day. So if you actually um, go over 300 per day, uh, Pinterest will actually give you a warning. That's like the, the cap, uh, 300 per day. Then you just um, get 150 followers. You could get more than that dep depending on the niche. So you, you start getting followers easily. Then what I'll do is let me just go and Google uh, a fishing Shopify store. So this is let's say fishing Shopify store. Okay, fishingmine.com. And let's just pretend this is my Shopify store here, and I want to promote this these baits right here. What I'm going to do is copy this and I will come back to and just hit this plus button and I'll click on save from site then paste the link right here then hit next and that will bring up all the images from the store so what I would actually do is actually uh, go into this and I would actually create an, an image and I would say discount this click here uh, uh, discount for this many days you know 24 hours until the price runs out from you know 29 50 percent off whatever you want there's so many things you can say and i'll just save one of these images and and i would also create a fishing board I'll just call it fishing and make sure you don't hit the secret button and create and that's it now, once you get you, within a month, you can easily easily get oh, within ten days, you can easily get uh, thousand five hundred followers, and you're pretty much guaranteed a sale all for free without any advertising. 
So there's really no excuse here to get this started. And what I've done right, right now is just promoted this other guys. What people are going to do is if they really like this product, they're actually going to go repin this. So let's say I, I'm, I'm into fishing and I've got a bunch of fishing uh, boards and I'm going to hit save. It's telling me that I've already saved it, but I'm going to save it onto my own board. So what Pinterest is all about is that people, it's, it's about people's hobbies. So my hobby is, is in design, architecture and all that, and traveling and all that. And I pin other people's, um, so traveling is one of my hobbies. What I've done here is I've actually pinned other people's um, pins on traveling, all their traveling images, all the places that I want to travel to. So imagine that, if you get 1,500 followers within 10 days about people uh, that are interested in fishing, you can easily get sales and this is this requ requires zero dollars in investment all you need is just a Shopify store or your own blog uh, your YouTube channel whatever you want so if you're new to my channel make sure you subscribe and like this video and stay tuned for more